I'm Aubrey. And I'm Amy. And, and you're watching Food Mania Review! Food Mania Review! Today we have a box from a viewer from Brazil! La, 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 la. Luciana sent us this amazing box, this beautiful box, and she was not joking around with the tape. Well wrapped. Well wrapped. All right. I don't think it was wrapped, it's just a box. Uh, well, I meant the tape, and then oh. it had paper on it. Oh, I took yeah. the paper off already. Yay! Look at this giant, this is a big box. And it's heavy too. There's a lot of stuff in here. Oh, and she wrote us a note to Amy and Aubrey. Dear Amy and Aubrey, let me start by saying that I'm a huge fan of you both and of your YouTube channel. I had just discovered it and already am completely addicted. I know that the box I have sent you is quite big, but I got big packages of all the snacks because it's easier to share. I promise I didn't put anything gross, and I really hope you like them. I also put a bunch of classic Kinder Eggs for Aubrey. Woo woo! Cool. Whoa. Looks like a haunted house. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, look at all this stuff. We can smell it all. Ah! I shall start reading the description of number one, which is this lovely bag of salty snacks. The first one is the only salty one. It is a typical snack food from Brazil and can also be made at home. Oh, oh. It is the Cassini Biscoito de Poldilho. I probably butchered that. Let's try it. Is it like peanuts? Poldilho. I don't know what Poldilho it is. Smell test. What is that? It's very different than anything I smell. It what looks just it? like Alone. air. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Is it good? It's not gross. I like it. You know what this tastes like? Pancake batter. What does that taste like to you? Toast. Toast. I like it though. I could see how you could just eat this like popcorn. Yeah, like with some dipping sauce as well. Ooh. Like yeah, jam. this needs like cheese dip. I like these. These are good. All right, that was, that's different. I've never had yeah. anything like that before. All right, that was cool. And this seems really good. It's called, um, Ooh, number two. Besita Blas. Lactabis. Lactabis. Lacta's probably it milk. It looks like, um, milk. Milk chocolate wafer. Ooh, like, and this one is Oreo. Yeah. Okay, it says, she says two and three. This one is kind of a Kit Kat. Normally when someone buys a box, they can't stop eating until they have finished the whole thing. I put the one version because I thought, I thought you might like them. I put the Oreo version because I thought you might like them. Oh, look, they're so cute. They're so they cute. come like that, individually wrapped. It looks like a package of gum, but it's not gum. Ooh, look, cute, they like that. So I guess it just looks like chocolate wafer. Yeah, mm, 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 mm. oh my God, it's so good. These are good. These are really good. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I could see how you could eat a whole box of these. Maybe they try to stop you by individually wrapping them all. Let's try the Oreo one and see if they're, if it's really different. Oreo one is cute, looks like that. So this one's white chocolate. Oh, yeah. So this one is chocolate wafers with white chocolate around it. Kind of like cookies and cream. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Mm, it's really good. I feel like Oreo is everywhere now. Yeah. Like it's an international cookie. Okay, these are amazing. Those ones are my favorite. Thank, yeah, I like the Oreo one a lot. Number four. The next one is really good. One of my favorite chocolates. We're ready. Oh wow, you sent us a whole thing of these. Oh, this is like a um, coconut. This is like a Mounds bar. Okay. Or another uh, I love one. these things so much. Naturalmente coco. I love Mounds, so these will be. This is a Prestigio by Nestle. And it's natural. It looks good. Mm-hmm. I love coconut chocolate candy. Mm, it's really good. Mm -hmm. Do you think this is better than the Mound? Very similar. We have a candy bar here called Mound. It's similar, except for it doesn't have as much sugar, I think. We have a Mounds bar here. We also have another version of that called the Almond Joy, which is a Mounds with almonds in it. Is there like molasses in this or something? It molasses? Like molasses. Well, I don't know. I can't read it. <laughs> Number five. I love caramel. Oh gosh, I don't know if you can. So this is one of my absolute favorites. They are sweet made from milk. <laughs> Can be homemade as well. This is the Portao de Cambuí. Dulce de Lite. 
It's like a caramel. As we say here in America, caramel. Do you say caramel or caramel? These look like they're gonna be very good. Oh, oh mom, so it's like crumbly, so I can eat it. Oh, okay. They're cute too because they have little cows on them. Yeah. Oh, I've had a candy like this. I don't love this. What does it taste like to you? It's a less chewy caramel, and it is more of like a crumbly consistency. It's not very caramelly though. Mm, I it's love it. Sugar. Number six. This is a really good chocolate. When my mom was a kid, she had a few friends over oh, overseas that asked her all the time to send them more. So send them some. Sonho de Valsa. Sounds like chocolate. Oh, is it crunchy inside? Oh, I ate an ASMR. It's like that inside. It's good. Oh. Is there peanut butter on the inside? Oh my God, it's so good. So it's milk chocolate on the outside. Like crunchiness and then peanut butter. Then there's a really thin layer of crunchy around. Yeah, I guess it's peanut, is it a peanut butter filling? Mm-hmm. It's really good. All right, this is amazing. I feel like I could just sit and eat this all day. Okay. So Aubrey and I have never been to Brazil. Yeah. The only places we've been have been here. Canada, Australia. Hawaii, which is part of the United States, but it's kind of far away. Australia, London. Been to many places in the United States. I've been to more places, but I've never been to Brazil. Ooh, Amy's banana. favorite banana. Ooh, I don't usually like, like banana, banana very much. Stuff. Number seven, I know that Amy is not a fan of artificial banana flavor. We do watch our videos. But this is supposedly made from banana pulp. I'm not a big fan of this candy, but it is very classic Brazilian sweet. Aubrey is saying you. Oh, I know. Oh wait, let me it's smell it. Very interesting smelling. It smells exactly just as stuff here at the barn. It's like molasses and oats, and it smells like this. This is Santa Fe Bala de Banana. It looks like a salt rock. Oh my and gosh. Salt lick. It's black. It's brown. Ah, ah. Oh my god, look, my white cuddle like this. With your big muscle. <laughs> Wow, I thought it was gonna be yellow, but it's brown, yeah, it's like very dark brown. But I guess, yeah, if it's natural, made from banana pulp. I'm just gonna pretend like it's yellow, so it's just gonna taste better. Nope. No, me gusta. It's not disgusting or anything, but it's very different tasting. It tastes exactly like molasses and oats. It does taste like molasses. I wonder if your horses would like this. Okay, this is very different. Okay, number eight. Is oh, it gum? This candy is raspberry flavored, and I eat one after the other, so this is one of your favorites. I love raspberry from um, like hard candies so much. This is Seven Bello. Oh, I like think seven, they're no, chewy. seven of Diamonds. It's mm. chewy. Yeah, like that's gonna be kind of like a Starburst or something. Yeah. I'm gonna eat this even though I shouldn't. Oh, it's really. I'm just gonna like. Maybe bite it from all these. No, it's in my mouth. Just bite it. Oh. <laughs> I'm just gonna let it melt in my mouth. Mm, good. Mm. Consistency of a Starburst, but even softer. It's so good. This is a dentist. Worst nightmare. Worst nightmare or favorite candy because it'll give you more cavities. Oh, sorry, I can't like put this really in the back of my mouth. <laughs> Boom. I always told my mom that at dentist offices, they should really put like lollipops and Charlie ranches and like really bad stuff like that so people come back more. If they were smart. Yeah, but like people don't do that. They like give, why? Then this would give away free candy. Okay, I'm gonna get the soda. The soda's next. This is called Guarana Antarctica Zero. This soda is really, really common here. It's made from a plant in the maple family, according mm. to Google. Drinking maple huh. syrup. Interesting. They're little cherries or something, but I don't think it's Who gonna knows? be cherry flavor. I don't want it to explode. I mean, it did come here all the way from Brazil. Smell this. Hmm. All I can so smell scary. is you. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, I, I went horseback riding. Smells like riding. a horse and a girl. Yeah, I went horseback riding this morning. Ooh, it smells good. Want me first? Sure. Oh, that's interesting. It's good. It's totally different. We don't have anything like that here. It's real. It's kind of light and crisp. It's not super syrupy like like our sodas are here. 
Because we use a, a lot of corn syrup in our sodas. I like it. Huh, that's interesting. Oh wait, I think this, is this zero, like zero calories? Is this a sugar-free one? Well, whatever this is, it's quite tasty. Yeah, that's good. It is good. It's really different. Yeah. I can't explain it. It's kind of like, it tastes a little bit like a watered down cola, but not gross. Yeah? Yeah, it's just kind of like sweet fizz. Yeah, but it's not super, well, I think it's a sugar-free, but it's not like all super, super sweet though. Yeah. I like good. it. I think it would work cooler, like it would be even better. It's just not very cold yet. She says, these are a few snacks we have here. I could send you loads of others. I really hope you guys like them. This box itself is really great to use as an organizer for anything, really. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thanks for letting me send you some Brazilian snack. All my love, Lucy. Luciana, this was amazing. It was really good. This is crazy good and you sent us so much stuff. Thank you so much for sending us. If you're from Brazil, tell us if you like these things and what some of your favorites are. And if you're not from Brazil, have you been to Brazil? Have you had some of these snacks? Now, if you go to Brazil, you know what things to check out. Yes, um, if you especially would, these things if you like raspberries. Oh my gosh, if you like Starburst or Chewy Candies or Now and Laters or uh, what's that other one that's a chewy one? I don't know, one? but it would be gross if I put this back in my mouth. Yeah, it would. Well, especially since we have a whole bag of them, I think you could okay. stick in your one. Or are you raised in a barn? Kind of. Yeah, a little bit. If you would like to send us something from mm. where you live, tell them where to send it, Aubrey. Oh, I mean, here, you can email us at foodmania.org. I don't no. know, not at my email. Foodmania review no. at gmail.com. Gmail you can send us an email at foodmanureview at gmail.com and we'll let you know how to get a package to us. You don't have to send us this much stuff. You are super generous in doing so, Lucy. Mm -hmm. um, but we love trying things from all over the world. Um, we'll attach some of our other videos that we've tried uh, foods from other countries. And, and also, you do not have to be like in a different country than us. No, we've if had people send us regional stuff. Too. <laughs> I'm sorry, I sound really weird. Yeah, if you're in the United States or somewhere in North America and have something really cool in your area that's local to your region, we'd love to try that as well. Food menu review at gmail.com. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. Oh, all those good things. Thing. Thank you so much for watching us. You guys are amazing. Luciana, you're amazing for sending us this stuff. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. I'm Amy. I'm Amber. <laughs> She's drooling. And you've been watching Food Mania Review. Peace.